This is Repairing Ecosystems by Kenneth, Eden, and Jean. What are repairing ecosystems? Repairing ecosystems are the interface between the land and river. They have very less vegetation. They have they're important for many cycles and they're terrestrial biome. Examples of repairing ecosystems. Here are some examples of the repairing ecosystems. And you can see here where they have very lush vegetation here. Where are repairing zones? Repairing zones are what happened where the banks of the river meet land. And they can be located along any body of water. This is a map of the repairing zone. Yeah, you can see right here, right beside the river, where you can see where like all the trees will be around here by the side of the river. Some of the benefits of repairing ecosystem are the water and like there's very lush plants for all of the animals. The benefits of repairing ecosystem are water, the nutrients, energy, cycle, energy flow, wildlife habitat, important for lodging, fishing and spacing, for animal and human activity. What is repairing vegetation? Repairing vegetation is very lush. It provides shade for many for shade and shelter for many animals, and the water keeps plants healthy. The nutrient-rich water can keep plants healthy, such as trees, herbs, and shrubs, etc. The plants are very lush and special, and green, etc. And green. Next slide. <laughs> Okay, here we are at Repairing Wildlife. Aiden will explain this slide. Repairing zones provide food and water for animals. And animals like to go to repairing <laughs> zones to rest, for shade, and mate. Less pollution in the water also is safer, like, habitat for livestock. We're a thousand miles. Here are cited works and credits. Here are all the all music the and the pictures. Uh, these are all picture links and all of the music. And unfortunately, that is the end. That is the end of this slide. But remember, that's all, folks. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas.